Hey, welcome back to my YouTube channel. We have Christy today, as you're so excited and you're not gonna believe what happened, is she got our package yesterday. And so we are here to open up all of the snacks that I sent her from New Zealand to test out. Now I picked out snacks that they definitely don't have in the US. So make sure you stay tuned to the end of this video to see it and subscribe to the channel. Here we go. Okay, you are not gonna believe this. So I get home from work, okay? Okay. She, okay I'm not quite ready yet. I, I gotta get there with the coffee. Okay. Oh my God. So I, okay, so I get home from work and yesterday was one of those crazy days. I go to the mailbox. What? We have been waiting for how many weeks? Did, when did you send I know. this? I how many weeks? It would be the time that we had that last video. Please stand by while I check. Yes, well, while you do that, I will. This is not an ad. This is me trying to be healthy, but I'm going to put chocolate syrup in it anyway, so I'm not sure how that helps. Wait, you thing. put chocolate syrup in your coffee? How would you make it taste chocolatey without okay. it? Okay, let me tell you what they do in New Zealand that's amazing, how they make mochas. One moment, oh. I now have to look at this. Four weeks ago, I sent it to you. What? I thought for sure somebody saw New Zealand, most perfect place to live, steal the package. That's what I thought happened. I did too. I totally thought it was stolen. So for all of you that don't know, I shipped her a package of goodies, if you didn't watch our last video, by of New Zealand oh. things. <laughs> what I did are not you doing? It? Stop. Well, I didn't shake it. Well, okay. Did you guys okay. get it to Ready Whip? Okay. Anyway. Yeah. We generally drink real cream here. Oh. Mm -hmm. I am from the cow state. <laughs> okay, so let me just tell you quickly about how they mocha, make mocha chinas here. They are amazing. So what they do is they give you two shots of espresso. It is, okay, just so you know, that's the perfect combination of coffee. Okay, mm. just so we're clear. You get two that's shots, yes. you put your milk in your jug, and then they would put the syrup, the chocolate syrup, or real bars of chocolate, or chocolate powder, doesn't matter. And then as you steam your milk, it melts and then you have like a chocolate milk and then you put that in your coffee and I'm telling you, you're doing it wrong. Yeah. Okay, why That's can't you do it? Can you mail that? <laughs> I mean, I got my Wisconsin shirt on today. I was I like, what should I wear? What should I wear? You know, you're sitting in your closet like, I don't have any idea what to wear. Correct. Be yeah, no, I know. I'm meeting well, my Wisconsin friend, so it got easier. Good job. Well, you know, I haven't done dishes like normal people do on a daily basis, so I can't find my Wisconsin cup. <laughs> I know our kids are on school holidays, so I've just, everything cool. just goes because there's no point in cleaning it because they're just going to no. mess it up in two seconds anyway. So yes, exactly. So we so, just okay. live in the fill. Okay. okay. I, can I just say on here for the customs declaration? Or maybe don't read that because I don't know what I put on there. <laughs> This is hilarious. Snacks. Wow. Thanks, Tara. She's real specific. I love presents. Oh, happy birthday month. <gasps> okay. Now, new, do New Zealanders do that? Birthday month? <gasps> you guys are going to die. Wait till I show you this. Oh, okay. Hold on. Can you read this, people? Can you read this? It um, says, it's my birthday month. <gasps> okay, so Christy, tell us a little bit about what you mean about birthday month, because maybe I've just adjusted in a different culture. <laughs> what? Oh, you need to come back. Come <laughs> back. So, birthday month for me, okay? Nobody else seems to understand it. October 1. So my birthday is October 21st. I'm going to be 29 again. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord. So basically, starting October 1st, I send out an email, maybe a text. It's my birthday month! I'm super Who do you send this to? Who do you send this Whoever to? Whoever the heck I want. It's so fun. And then I pretend like I'm Oprah, except with a smaller budget. And then I will buy some of my favorite things and give them away. Remember when she used to do that? 
Do you people know who you Oprah give is? Them, you buy them and you give them away on your birthday month. Just to be clear. Mm -hmm. Just so you know, yeah. I'm available for the giving. So bad with birthdays. Even my whole family. <laughs> it, unless you could, came out of this body, I don't remember. 21. 21. Yeah. Because remember, we had a, my mom had a surprise party for me. You were there. Yeah, I remember. Yeah. <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> Was it like your golden birthday, your 21st on the 21st? Yes. Remember, we had gone camping mm -hmm. and we got home. She doesn't remember. I, you know what, though? <laughs> the only reason why I remember is because I have a picture. Seriously, this is why I take pictures. Our followers are going to be very excited because they've been wanting you. They've been saying, where's yeah. Chrissy? Oh, where's you guys Chrissy? are so good to me. <laughs> I'm telling you what. Um, I hope there's not a safety person on, like, hey, you're holding the scissors wrong. Um, because, oh, okay. I just, I really love presents. Do you guys love presents? I love presents. I love presents. I love presents. Okay, are you guys ready? Okay, these people are going to totally know what these are, and I'm not. Well, yeah, we have a lot of Americans on here, okay. too. So I'm just grabbing is... one at a time because okay. I like the surprise. Okay, you're looking at it first. Okay, now sweet chili sour cream chips. They don't really have Ooh. those there, so I wanted no, to try them. don't. Because their potato okay, chips he here in New Zealand are fantastic. Are you just... Are you ready? Go for it, go for it. Ready? <laughs> That's pretty good. Of course it is. Even though it's been it, sitting in the plane for... bad in it. How is that a thing? Yeah, everything is so different what than the state. Guys? There's no MSG in it? <gasps> you can't get no. a, like a rash from eating it. That's amazing. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. These, These are, are a lot healthier in general. I could explain that all, but that's another video. Okay. I like salty with sweet, so I can't wait to see what else is. Oh, this is really good. Yeah, so those are the kettle chips, so they'll be a little extra crispy. Oh, that's awesome. Next. Okay, open the box. Oh, my gosh. Oh, the chocolate. Is that chocolate? Ooh. Oh, it's chocolate! <laughs> I love chocolate. Oh, my word. Okay. I got fish or a shield? It's a chocolate fish. And so here you'll get those with any coffee. A lot of coffees that you order, they'll put a chocolate fish on the side because you always like to have a little chocolate with coffee. Yeah. Okay. Hold on. Let me just make this official. So it's a, it's, it would be like marshmallow inside. Oh, or that you could do that. <laughs> oh, that's great. Mm. No, I love them. Is that strawberry? What is it? Does it taste it's strawberry? Mm -mm. No, mm -hmm. because their marshmallows are, are like, pink what is for that? Reason. For some reason, it's pink. I don't know why. Why is it pink? I love pink. Why not? I love pink too. So their marshmallows are white and pink always. And I don't know why. That's a good question. I got to figure that out. It doesn't taste like our marshmallows. No, it's a different marshmallow. So you should see me trying to make Rice Krispie treats here. Different marshmallows. I and have they an American store. Yeah, it's not, a, it doesn't work. They're probably just better for you. I got to figure out that difference. Another goal. Look at this. You're just signing me up for jobs. Always, and I'm just here to cheer you on and eat the chocolate. Okay, I think, okay, this is not a fish. It's a squatty one, but I feel oh. like it's marshmallowy too. Nope, that is what's called a pineapple lump. So what they've done in New Zealand is combine chocolate and pineapple. How have we not done this in the U.S.? Yeah, yeah that's not, we don't do that here. Hold no. on. What is happening? Hmm. It's making me drooly. Yeah, it's a little bit chewy. You know, it's like it's happy, but I love the, I love the pineapple. Too. Yeah. You know what? Here's my thought. You just cannot go wrong with chocolate, okay? Cover, I don't care what you cover with it. Oh, what's that? Is that a cookie? Oh, that's a Tim Tam. Have you had a oh! Tim Tam? I've, it's like, it's like a I've British, it. it's a British biscuit. Oh, it's a biscuit. You will. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love yeah. it. Okay, one moment. And, oh, no, I am out of water. So, so when I come to the States, lots of friends request those. They're familiar with them. They're not like, you know, exclusively New Zealand, but I just thought I'd send you one. Mm. Oh. Those are good too. 
I really like eating. <laughs> so of those three, which one do you like the best? Mm. Chocolate fish, pineapple lump, or Tim Tam? And that's just a regular standard original Tim Tam. The fish. Tim -tam. I really like the fish. Okay, so there's a skinny one like this. Yes. Okay. Or, ooh. So I'm a little bit frustrated because, oh yes, the peanut slab. Both are good. But go with the other one. Go with the this, mint. This guy? Okay, so this the one. mint Whitakers is amazing and normally it's like liquid mint, but I sent you that one because of the size. I was just trying to go small and light because it was still $30 to ship it to you. This? Yeah, for that little box. Yeah. So I was like, okay. So yeah. So that's why I just kind of took everything out. And so that one is, that'll just have the mint flavor. It won't have the gooeyness. So I'm a little frustrated about that. I might have to send you oh. oh, I'm good with it. I'll be here. <laughs> All right. This is what it looks like. Smell yeah, it's it. dark chocolate. It's a dark it's chocolate. Minty. Do you like dark chocolate? Is that a dumb question? Mm -hmm. I like all chocolate. <laughs> oh, Ooh, that is good. That's super smooth. Yes. Do you taste how good that is? Oh. So that's like the premium brand here or the one that. Oh, that's really good. So you have that is really good. Okay. Which brand do you miss from here? from the u.s or is it like no now that i've been in new zealand i've had real chocolate and real coffee mm -hmm. i don't miss anything from the states that's a that's a good question uh in terms of chocolate uh not a lot because honestly it's actually a lot better so when i first when i you know we come to the states every year and i think oh i'm so excited to have you know a butterfinger and a snickers well they have snickers here but like yeah. uh, like a butter yeah butterfinger they have a hokey what do they have it's i can't think of the name of it but um the like Reese's Pieces and like yeah. butter cups I miss because they don't do a lot of peanut butter chocolate. People don't love peanut butter here. So, what? but they do have a Whitaker's peanut butter and they do have, and that's, I try not to buy it because I eat the whole thing. Oh, I would eat the whole thing. It's so good. So, and they've just more and more peanut butter. Like every year I've just noticed it's becoming more popular. So, um, so those I kind of miss, but not really. Like, so when I go back, I'm always disappointed. And here's a true story. And I can't believe I'm going to say this to you. Uh oh. Because I bring a lot of chocolate for my friends and then I don't give it to them. Oh. Because, <laughs> because I look so look forward to the chocolate in the US and then I taste it and I'm like, I don't want to eat that. I want to eat that. <laughs> and so then I just eat that. Because, like, when you're in the States for a month, you're like, and you're <laughs> used to that flavor, like, it's just, it's hard. Yeah. It's well, a stressful time. It's, you know, you're seeing your family for a whole month. Like, I need some chocolate. <laughs> and, yeah and then where do you drink coffee then if your coffee is like you said it's oh doesn't your dad say that like you're you're like the coffee snob is that I probably do have a little bit of a reputation in my family because oh you drink, do a little the drip, drip coffee and i'm telling you that is my biggest struggle back in the states because the coffee at starbucks is disgusting i used to love it until i was informed uh, but the good news is, is my parents live right next to like an outpost, which has like an organic cool. coffee and like, you know, espresso. Yeah. You can't get espresso everywhere in the U.S. It's like oh. only at cafes or only at specific ones. And it's so good. So that's good. But like the thing is, is I have to sneak out in the morning and go get it. And then, you know, my dad is always up early and he's like, oh, my coffee isn't good enough for you. <laughs> I love it. Like, nope. Oh, the thing is, is like when you're on holiday, you don't want to spend your time in a migraine. So no, it is what no. it is. Just give it me the coffee. Oh. oh, the peanut slab. So is, is this- to try that? <laughs> is this the closest thing I'm going to get to like Reese's Pieces here? No, no. Peanut slab. Oh, good question. No, it's just like a chocolate covered peanut. There's just peanuts inside. Oh, seriously? How fun is that? I'll tell you. Oh, that's good. Every, okay. Like chocolate covered peanuts are my favorite. So I just sent you my favorite. I don't know how to decide. That's so good. Okay. Everything tastes like, what is the word? I guess less processed. I don't have another yeah, word. Yeah, like that is totally it. It's so, okay. Why do we process everything? For, is it because um, it's cheaper? Make it in large quantities and for profit. Well, don't you have large quantities where you are? No, we don't have, we only, you know, we have barely 5 million people. 
Oh. <gasps> Did you not send me? Hold on. I feel like Genoa or Jehovah or what yeah, is the name? Genoa. I sent you the Fajoa. Is this it? Yes, it is. Yeah! I was hoping for Fajoa. Okay, wait, okay, wait. So, okay, it's the green one that's okay. in there, and it's called a sour Fijoa lolly. That's what they call it here, lolly. Yeah, that candy. I'm super excited about this. But it's amazing how this particular candy has it has encompassed the actual taste of Fijoa. So this, there you go. This is like literally how I can get people to try it. Here we go. Okay. Clear, yeah, yeah. So this is clear the palate. Okay. You like sour? Do I stick the whole thing in my mouth? Yes, put the whole thing in your mouth. What are you doing? Oh my gosh, you eat it like a child. Oh. Bite Ooh. it, bite it, bite it. Don't suck on it, it's chewy. Oh my gosh. Do you what taste that? The perfect yeah. sweet sour. That's it, what it is. That's what it, oh my gosh. It totally is. Does it make you drool? I'm having drool issues. Okay. I literally can't stop buying them. It's a problem. That is the weirdest feeling of the combination of the two because I was like, what is that? It's like, but sweet. Go Fajoa. Go get yours today. Mm, that was just a natural commercial for you. <laughs> thanks for letting me be on your YouTube channel. Oh my gosh, channel. thanks for trying everything. It was so good to check. Thank and you. Up. So. I will make sure I have all the things. 